Yeah, it's I fun. saw him playing Robin earlier, just yeah. in friendlies. So maybe, but Excel's looking around too. Maybe they're. I've seen his Lucas. I've seen his Falco. I've seen his Zero Suit. Who hasn't seen his yep. Zero Suit? If you haven't seen Zero Suit, then I don't know why you're watching the stream right now. <laughs> <laughs> and but I've not seen his Robin before, so this is gonna be pretty fun to watch for me. Yeah, should be a good set. Two, uh, two not so common characters. Got a fast faller, and you got a very interesting character in Robin. Both slow characters, though, so neither are going to get uh, either big advantage or big disadvantage when it comes to the speed yeah. department. I think, I know, like, all of Robin's frame data is, like, really bad in terms of, like, the initial hitbox coming out. Not necessarily the proportion of, like, the strength to the hitbox, but just, like, there's, there's no, like, oh, that's my fast option. Like, Robin doesn't really have that. Um, for... Uh, for Falco, I'm not totally sure, but I feel like he's got a few fast things. Like his forward air seems to. His come forward up air is pretty good. Down throw the forward air is pretty good. Yeah. Um, back airs, if you space them, they're pretty good. Um, try doing that doesn't work. Nice neutral air right there. Gets him with the up tilt. I mean the up air. I mean, sorry about that, folks. Both playing very, um, very slow match. We got two slow characters. Both of them have fairly slow moves. Yep, that's a that's a combo right there. But the that um, is a brutal yeah. thing from uh, from Robin. But he has to. I think Excel has some DI ability, I guess. Yeah, he has some DI ability. But I don't know. Uh, you know, the percentages might have not just worked out, or Mars just read it correctly. A little bit of both, probably. And X and um, Robin has a lot of strong moves. They don't. They're not the quickest moves in the world, but yeah. if you get a lot of, like throw combos. Um, a lot of her um, projectiles can really convert into like aerials. So yep. especially that's with the eleven sword. Oh yeah, eleven sword's brutal when you do have it. Does a ton of damage. So both of them playing pretty patient right now. Not really doing a lot. Playing a lot of footsies as Mars gets two forward airs in a row. Mars going for the up tilt to uh, to catch XL's landing. Didn't quite hit, and now he's off stage for it. Both of them playing very patient right now. Tried it again. There we oh, go. The re <laughs> That's a reflector. <laughs> the double reflex. So he tried the arc fire the first time, didn't reflect. Tried it again for some odd reason, and didn't work. But I guess he wanted to mess him up a little bit, so to see if he could throw the arc uh, thunder out, and it did. So yeah. good job by XL. Who would reflect twice? Yeah. Bingo. Yeah. You know what? Just the mind game. Sometimes you have to play really stupid like that. You gotta spam a yeah. move several times because like, if you're playing pro, you don't expect someone to spam a move. So right. you do it every now and then. It's gonna throw your opponent off guard. Excel's got a little bit of work to do to catch up here. And he doesn't have a lot of options to ap approach with other than probably Reflector and maybe just like a grab or a dash attack, which isn't this. Even dash attack isn't even that good of a move. Down throw doesn't convert anything off of it. Both of them perfect shielding. Oh my goodness. Nice. nice forward air. And Excel's oh, basically that, back that in this game. Been, uh, tries to go for the up smash, misses it. Good evasion by Mars. Knowing uh, where XL would probably go. Oh, the fast he was going for the there. highlight reel, but he just couldn't get it. Yep. I want to gone crazy. So, Mars gets the first game. Pretty slow game overall, but at the end of the day, Mars takes takes the first game. So, um, yeah, we might see XL switch off now, or no? They're just maybe they just sort of saw the bracket and said, "Well, probably end up meeting he later. Was, Let's go see." Yeah, it's it fudge. Let's play like a, a little bit of a friendly tournament match. Yeah. Or, Secondaries or pocket characters. Let's see how this goes. So, I like that from them. So we're going to um, town Tiny and city, city now. Um, I'm not sure who this is really going to benefit. Um, I don't think this really benefits either characters. I think it might benefit Robin a little bit more because um, Robin can do a lot when someone is above them on a platform. Oh, yep. And Falco can too, but not when the platforms are so high. Oh yeah, like Falco has a pretty good up tilt and up smash that can really punish you really hard. But uh, Robin can jump and do that. So. Yeah. So yeah, I never even thought of that. I'm so stupid. Yeah. So she definitely short hop into like up air. You know, she doesn't have the biggest, the longest sword in the game, but she has a sword, so it does give her some range over Falco when it comes to platforms. And same thing with Falco. What you say when the platforms are lower down, he can do up tilts or probably a little bit of up, up airs as well. So. Ooh. <laughs> XL Don't. trying to reflect the sword, but it's just sort of a weird timing. Throws. I think Please. that was a book, right? Yeah, that was a book. Yeah, for sure. Doesn't get anything off it. Nice Good. forward air there. Yeah, like the, that fading forward air was the, the exact hitbox placement that XL needed. 
I tried to punish off it, but couldn't get yeah, it. Yeah, this is a melee. I don't know why Excel's trying out that. He's trying to do the uh, west been... balls um, down, <laughs> down air, but it's not working yeah. for him. Nice down smash, though. Um, um, kind of punishing the um, end lag on that move. Gets a throw. Wow. Tries to get for the um, forward smash. Really Doesn't get it, though. That, that like Just that concept was really interesting follow. That was a fantastic Nosferatu coming out. Getting, getting Mars a little bit more percent. And his sword's pretty strong right now, so you got to watch out if you're yeah. XL. Don't want to get hit by it, especially so, on a conversion. So it was interesting that the, he actually successfully reflected the Levin Sword, but it just it dissipated before it could go far enough. Mars getting another one of those. Up and smash, he gets definitely the up smash. That's up the slowest yeah. up smash I've seen in a, a, a spacey ever in any game. Holy yep. shoot. Dang. Great combo by Mars. And he had to watch out for that. It happens. Down throw to the up air, especially when your sword's really strong. It comes out like that, you're dead. So they're both pretty even right now. This is anyone's game. Nice. Uh, I mean, XL could have held the the shield he had out, but it was either way going to be a lot of pressure that he would have had to deal with. So good, good follow up by Mars, knowing to down throw and then just hold that jab out. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Because Falco is a fast follower, so that yeah. was definitely going to work. That's Even like pretty legitimate, like Robin knowledge. To oh know yeah, how to do that too. Like, <laughs> it's not just randomly picking a character in his buns, which I mean, he is. <laughs> But Mars is a smart enough player that he can do some pretty intelligent things with that character. Well, we've seen it. He's, seen, he's, done, he's done the down B several times. He's done, you know, some pretty yeah. known Robin stuff as well. So he knows this character inside and out. He knows the hitboxes. He knows what, wor he wor what works, what and what doesn't work. But right now, this is on um, Exile's game a little bit. Has stage control a little bit. Mars trying to regain, regain it, and he, do and he does. So both have both in neutral right now. Let's see what they can do here. Good patience by Mars when he was in there. He could have thrown out an option early, and Excel could have punished it, and possibly even have been the game with either one hit or a string. But Mars just waited, didn't know what Excel was going to do, and then once he got in range, or once he got out of range of Excel's possible like sort of easy follow-ups, he did a backer to throw that out, and knew it was pretty safe. And I realized I'm like going off in one particular situation, but it's just like a really intelligent choice to do that backer <laughs> to put pressure on, but not overextend. Speaking of back airs, um, that just killed. <laughs> Speaking of back airs. <laughs> so Falco's back air. Tying the setup. Pretty useful tool, and it does kill. So we're looking at a 1-1 right now, winner's finals. So Both of them played pretty well. Neither did anything particularly bad. So I can't really yeah. complain out of the way or give them thumbs up or anything because they're playing the so character perfectly, both of them. Because this is a best of five, they probably... They might switch off now. No, <laughs> things are getting oh, Falco heavier. dittos? Are we getting Falco dittos? Or maybe XL will go Robin. We'll switch off. Who knows? Oh, that'd be funny. Is he going Robin? Uh, he's, he's going Bayo. No, Bayo. Okay. All right. Now this is a bad matchup for Falco. If I know anything, I'm gonna assume yeah, it is. Very likely. Yep. Fast faller plus Bayo equals you are dead, son. You are dead. So game three, we're going to Battlefield. Um, I would say good stage for Bayonetta. So let's see how this rolls out. Yeah, decent stage for Bayo because. It's such a huge stage, so there's more survivability, and Bayo has a great recovery and can come back from a lot. Oh, yeah. Falco, he's, a, he's got a, a long recovery between his side B and his up B, but it's still not anywhere close to what Bayo can do. Yeah, it isn't that good. It, it's pretty solid, but it isn't great. Nice down that smash down right smash there. so unexpected, but I, that's why he it works, probably. Gets him in the witch time. Up there. Great, great string. Didn't have the uh, successful finish to it, but was able to get a lot of damage in. Nice job. Wow. Nice Perfectly spaced back air. Oh, that yeah. That was tight. Exile knows his character pretty well. And um, Mars having a very hard time approaching right now. Falco almost breaks his shield. Yeah, getting back air. That was intense. Back air is very powerful, so half of one more time, it would have been broken. <laughs> Good DI by Excel avoiding that laser. That could have been a lot worse. Oh, wow. nice spike. Mars, Mars showing Excel how uh, how Falco has played. How Falco has played. I don't care how slow that, that down there is. You can still hit it. If you Mars, you can still hit it. And very smart recovery there by him. Yep. Good good shield to the... To and we were talking about earlier how this is um, Excel's game, and now just with one spike, it's now... It's actually... Uh, yeah, it's, it's Mars' game now. Yep. It's officially <laughs> has the lead in percent. Trying for another <laughs> down air, try to disrespect him, but that's not gonna work. XL fishing for the kill right now, and that's, that's gonna kill. Oh, nope. nice EI then. Spoke way too soon. 
Forward air is pretty strong, but it's not super strong. And she also had like no rage, so there's yeah, no, that too. no beneficial factor in terms of that. Yeah, if your ex XL really wants this to go really bad, and that's definitely going to kill. If that doesn't kill, then oh my goodness, all right, that doesn't kill. <laughs> I was thinking at least 175 yeah, or something. Yeah, I'm sure Mars is used to having DI Bayo's grabs and knows like the exact angle for it. Oh, wow, oh, that's that unfortunate. So uh, there's that little spike that you think would just be a little disrespectful, I know. Said, but it, he it, did it pretty intelligently. It was the game changer. Had a very comfortable league, gets the spike, and XO fishing for the kill and couldn't get it. It really cost him, him there, so we're looking at a 2-1 right now, Mars having the lead. Might see XL pick Cloud, or who knows? You, Maybe he, you would think, feeling Bayo still. They're going Falco, Dittos. They're going Falco. And we're going to Battlefield 2. Game 4, Battlefield. Let's see what happens here. Oh, we got here. the Falco Ditto. Yeah, okay. they got the Falco Ditto. Oh, Falco Dittos. Oh, shoot. The Footstool doesn't get anything off it, though. Yeah, way too low percentage. Way too, really way too low percentage. To yep. Good good sort of mini combo there with the, the up tilts. Similar to Mario's, but just not as... Uh, not as... Not as good, not, not as, as fast. Not string. Yeah. yeah. Trying for the side B. Doesn't work to his advantage. Gets the up throw in the up air. Nice. Excel oh. missing that laser turn around the wrong way. We got some neutral game going on here. Some advanced mind Truly games. neutral game with yep. neither player hitting <laughs> buttons. That that is like the the epitome of neutral game when actually nothing has happened. As soon as a as soon as a player does something, it's not totally neutral anymore. <laughs> it's like as soon as there's a commitment, then it's not just you know, something is happening. Something's and it's happening not in the match. Yeah. It's not like a complete standstill. Yeah, so that standstill is like the ultimate neutral game of like anything can happen right now. And the only time that usually a neutral game, like a perfect neutral happens is at the start of a match. <laughs> so weird to see. Misses the four area there. Nice shield by XL. And gets a ni wow. nice back air by um, yep. Mars. And he wants to walk away from winning the grand finals for the second week in a row. Winners finals. We're in winners right now. Oh, no, yeah, he's one stock away from going to Grand Finals. Oh, going to. Yeah, going to Grand winning. Finals, okay. yeah. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> a nice dash attack. A nice neutral area. Gets the jabs. Is he going for the... Oh. Yep, that was good offstage pressure. Excel was able to punish it after a little bit, but Mars not quite dying from it, and he's probably going to keep that pressure on again. Yep. But if you're Mars, you want to attack on a percentage because you're about to die any moment now. So Excel switching it up though and getting a great forward air. Throwing out like that hitbox just stays over so long and is so strong. Mars barely living. <laughs> nice choice there using the reflector. Oh, oh Try to be Mars fancy there. That. That Trying to go for the brutal. spike. And let's him though, yep. and gets the back air. Mars still with a pretty good lead, but uh, yeah. you know, both like, really good players. Excel could convert off of a lot. Yeah, he could definitely come back from this. So we can see a spike. We can just see him win neutral a ton. Anything can happen. This is not. This is definitely not a done game for Excel by any means. Can't punish it. Wow. Charges the down smash on the way. Doesn't break shield though. And I would. And Mars knew he could kind of do that because it, he has such insane reaction time that as soon as he saw Excel release that shield and go for something, that he'd release the down smash and probably catch him with it. So Excel's best choice was to wait and hope that he did it prematurely. Oh, yeah. We're going to see a spike. No? Nope. Okay. Nice Mar sport. Yeah, I think that was smart on Excel. He saw the opportunity for a spike. He was like, all right, well, I, I got to make it so that he cannot spike me. <laughs> and Excel having a hard time gaining his percent. Oh, missed the punish there. That, that could have been the yeah. game. On the wrong side for down tail. Gets to dash attack. Nice. This reflector reflector into the down to smash. down smash. Mars see, taking it. What you don't see all the time, it, it, what separates Frogs from Falco is that reflector can be used offensively for Falco. It can be. Oh, absolutely. It can be used every now and then.